Alrighty, hello guys, welcome to Faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are continuing on with this thing, which is actually our... I don't know what we would even call it. A small military boat is... or a small military ship is what I've called it. And a few of you guys have said, that thing is not small. It is. It is actually very small. Um, when we actually put this thing in a size comparison with, I don't know, let's say a helicopter, the helicopter is going to be very big on this thing, as long as... well, unless we make a very, very small helicopter. Which we might have to do, I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, landing a full-scale proper helicopter on this thing, this will look tiny, I'm not gonna lie. Um, so yeah, that's why that gun looks so big. Realistically, that gun isn't that big, but it is, in, in terms of the size of this. Uh, but anyway, what we're gonna do today is we're actually gonna go ahead and try and make some rooms on the inside. Uh, we're gonna try and put this into some sort of room as well. And uh, yeah, we're gonna go from there, so let's get on with it, shall we? Let's go. Okie dokie, so first things first then, let's just go ahead and grab the seat and then we'll grab everything else from this and hopefully all will go well. So, uh, where is the seat? Hang on, where even, where even is it? There it is, okay, grab the seat, grab all of this, grab all of that, there we go, awesome. Uh, go down and grab all of the floor bit? The floor bit? I don't know. Yeah, it's, it's all like one huge microcontroller. Um, so there you go, uh, grab all of that, there we go, go ahead and cut it. And move it away. Woo! There we go. Right, delete all of this as well because it is highly unnecessary. And we're going to go ahead and put this inside. So I'm thinking that the control room for all of the guns and stuff can actually go at the front. All right, we're going to put it literally right here, right in the middle for right now because that's the main gun. There we go. Paste that and merge it in. All right, awesome. We're then actually going to go ahead and paint this on the floor. And that is brilliant. Yeah, good. So this is going to be the room to control all of the, uh, what are we going to call it? All of the, I'm just going to say stuff, <laughs> um, but I don't know whether we should be calling it just stuff. I'm not sure, but uh, yeah, that works. All right, delete all, oh, we can't delete all of that. Delete all of this to a certain point, to about there. Delete all of this to a certain point as well, and this will work. Yeah, that'll be fine. Then we've obviously got to do this on the other side, so let's do that real quick. Do, 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 do. There we go, awesome, bring that across there, and put this in here like so, very nice. We're then actually going to attach these two on, very nice, and I guess this bit needs doing too. I kind of want to do it the other way around though, I want to do it like this. I know that's weird, but I kind of like that, that's cool. So, essentially this right here is our gun um, control seat. We're going to have like a big thing up here of monitors. Because I want to like be able to see what's going on, even if I'm not on the gun. Let's say someone else is in the game. I want to be able to see what they're doing. So I want to kind of put this here. Oh, this is risky though. This is kind of risky though. Oh, it doesn't really fit. This one doesn't really fit. What about this one? This one fits. All right, so we're going to put this right about here. We'll flip it over, put it in. Excellent. So we'll do all of that. Good. So that's going to be one of the monitors. Um, uh, We need like some dials and stuff in here as well. Uh, so that we can see how much ammo we've got left. Unless this tells us. I'm not sure this does tell us. I'm not sure. Okay, well anyway, we're going to go ahead and put a door across here so that we can actually get in and out of that room. So let's go ahead and whack this on here straight away. Awesome. And then we'll actually just go ahead and fill this in so that it all works. There we go. Brilliant. So now we can actually get into the, uh, the gun room. <laughs> the gun room. And that's brilliant. I don't know what else we're actually going to have in here. I feel like we're going to have some missile launchers. I know the ship is tiny, but I feel like some missile launchers would be pretty good. Um, and the way that I want those to work is I kind of want them just pointing sort of like an X. Or maybe like even further over. One fires off in that direction and then one fires off in this direction. Giving us a little bit of coverage from the sky. Which I think works, maybe. I don't know. I don't actually know where they'd, they'd get put though. I'm really not sure about that. So, yeah. I don't know. Maybe some missiles on the side of here would work, but I'm not sure. Um, so yeah, that's good. Anyway, uh, let's get some more of these in. Do, 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 do. We'll put in like one here. Oh, that didn't work. I kind of want it to be bigger than that, actually. Let's go with two by threes. Here we go. So two by three, we can actually just put that in straight away. We'll then put another one of those in right here as well. And we'll put some seats, uh, looking at those. So seat is what we need. Passenger seat. We'll actually put that right there. Put another one right there. And we'll fill this in. There we go. All right, brilliant. That works. 
Yeah, that totally works. All right, so now I'm going to go with the brown bit. Here we go. I'm going to paint this, paint this, and paint this. And that'll be good. And then I want the floor painted uh, in certain areas. Because I don't want it to be green everywhere, I don't think. So paint all of these in where there's a hole. There we go. And paint all of this. Yeah, nice. So the different stations can have different paints. Uh, and I think that'll be okay. All right, good. Uh, anything else that really, really should be in here? I'm not sure. I really don't know. All right, so I'm thinking we actually add cameras everywhere so that we actually know what's going on. So we're going to have a camera in this room all the way at the back. We're actually going to go ahead and put it right here like this. Uh, essentially, what that's going to allow us to do is watch this room. So we'll have a camera watching this, uh, which will go to one of these seats. We need another camera somewhere else. In fact, we can have three more cameras in other places. Uh, we'll have one on the flight deck, so we'll actually have one right here. There we go. Awesome. Uh, we'll have more, so we actually need one probably on the front of the ship. We'll actually just add it straight into here. There we go. Awesome. That'll be good. Uh, any more? So that's one, two, three. We need one more. We need one more, and I don't know where to put it. I don't know where to put it. No. Um... Maybe inside of here, just in case. Yeah, so we can actually have a, uh, one just in here as well. That would work. Um, so yeah, no. Yeah, this is fine. This is fine. So let's go ahead and just attach these to all of these, and then we'll be good to go from there. So attach this to there, attach this to there, attach it to there. Also attach it to this camera. Attach this camera to this camera, and this camera to this camera. There we go. And then all of these to each other. There we go. Awesome. Uh, and currently we don't actually have any electricity that's properly in here yet, so we do actually need to do all of these. Um, which is a bit annoying, but there you go. All of these need adding. So there we go, we're doing it. We're totally doing it. Nice. Build these ones backwards, into there, excellent. We need to do these ones as well. There we go, awesome. All the way forwards. Straight to there, straight to there, straight to there, straight to here. There we go, excellent. Attach those to each other, attach them backwards. And there we go. And then we need to do all of these as well. There's a lot that needs doing here. Realistically, we should have some breakers for these, but I don't think we really need them. I think it's fine the way they are. So there we go. We'll attach those to each other. We'll then attach this to there. And then to all of this. Because we don't have a battery yet. We don't actually have a proper battery. Uh, this has to attach up to there. We'll also attach it to each other. And we'll send it backwards as well. There we go. All right, nice. Yeah, this works. This totally works. All right, there we go. Good. So all of that is actually fine. That is brilliant. Um, yeah. All right, good. So now we're going to attach the cameras to each one of those um, thingamabobbies. I don't want it to really be useless, but at the same time, it is sort of useless doing this. Uh, but I think that's okay. Um, right, okay. So this one's going to show the flight deck, and then this one is going to show uh, the engine room. Okay, that's fine. And then we can have certain, like, things for each of those from here, that are controlled from here. So we can turn on the lights and stuff for, for the helipad from here. We can turn on the engine and stuff from this one. Um, one of them is just the front of the ship and one of them is just in here, so that won't do much. But, um, I guess that would be cool. Alright, awesome. So, do they all have it? Yes, they do. They're all good. We need a button for each one of these to be able to turn them on. We'll grab the right color and we'll just put it in. Here we go. So, delete this. Whack it straight into there. Excellent. Do the same thing right here. And then we'll attach that to each one of these. So electricity first. There we go. Electricity, electricity. And then attach them straight up. So that goes to there. This goes to here. This goes to here. And this goes to here. Very good. All right, nice. So essentially, all of those cameras should now work. Let's go see. All right, so that's, that's the front. That's this room. Yep, and then that's the back. And then this is the engine room. So if we have any engine fires... In fact, fire suppression can go in here as well. Uh, and we can pretty much control everything from this room. This is going to be the control room. That makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. Yeah. Okie dokie. So I've actually put three more buttons in here because this is the helipad seat. What we're going to do is we're going to have... Um, da -da 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 -da, red? No, yellow. Yellow light. That's like on and off. So that's fine. That's good. We'll attach this to all of those, which is this one, this one, and this one, and also these ones. There we go. Nice. We need helicopter, sorry, helipad um, deck lights. 
There we go. Helipad deck lights. And then we need helipad spotlights. There we go. Awesome. So this will go to the deck lights, which are the ones on the sides. Here we go. One there. One there. One there. One there. One there. And one there. There's a lot of these, but that's okay. There we go. One there. One there. One there. One there. One there. And one there. All right. Excellent. So we're going to attach all of those to those. That's good. We've got an extra battery right here. Uh, realistically, this should be the one for the, the entire thing. Well, it shouldn't, but it is. So there you go. Anyway, um, right, that's all in. So it should all be attached. Uh, this needs to be attached to there. Excellent. Uh, if we now spawn this in, we get inside, we should be able to control the lights from there. Let's have a look. So no lights on at the moment. In fact, let's make it nighttime so you definitely know. There you go, no lights. There should be a flashing light in the middle. Helipad lights, which are the yellow ones. All right, yellow lights are on. Excellent. Turn those off. Oh, we can actually see it from here, look. Yellow lights on, yellow lights off. Deck lights. That actually looks pretty sick. I like that. Turn those off. Spotlights, we don't currently have. We don't currently have any spotlights, but we should. So, spotlights are the next things that need adding. Um, realistically, I kind of want to add them to here. But I want them to point downwards. I do. I really want them to point downwards. And I'm not sure putting them there is, is the right way of doing that. I'm not sure. Anyway, ladder is also something that needs putting in. We'll put it all the way down here. Excellent. And we'll get rid of them a little bit at a time. Yes. Alright, there we go. Get some pipes and whack those in. Excellent. Eh? There we go. Very nice. And very nice. Okay, that works. That totally works. Yeah. Um, because, yeah, we didn't actually have a way of getting down here or up here last time, but now we do, so that's all good. Uh, with that being said, we're actually going to delete the... Oh, we can't really delete any of those. That's not what I want. Uh, we need a pivot uh, that is going to go next to this. We'll make it the same color, but it's going to go next to it, so like this. There we go. Uh, we'll attach one of these straight into there, point it downwards, and that'll be brilliant. Yeah, this will totally work. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, we're also going to make the actual light that comes out of it very dark. We're going to make it this color, and that should be good. All right, delete these. Um, we'll have this attached to there. We'll attach this to there. We'll also do these two. Very good. Um, and then we'll try and figure it out from there. So um, the lights need to turn on. We'll use this to do that. There we go. And realistically, controlling the actual pitch of these would be very nice too, but we can't. We're not going to do it like that. So, we'll have those set at a number. Let's do that. And the number is going to be like 0 point... 0 point 0.3? 0 point 0.3, maybe? I don't know. I don't know. We've got a little area to hide it, right? In here? No, we don't. Oh, yeah, we do. Down here. Is this filled in? I'm very confused. Uh, right, we're actually just going to go ahead and put it right there. And we'll paint this that color. Uh, if we can. There we go. Excellent. So, we attach this to there. We also attach it to there. And we make it something like 0.3. Okay, excellent. I think that's pointing them in the right direction. I believe it is. I can't see a single thing. I can't see. Oh, I'm in the room. Okay, good. Uh, turn this on. Turn the spotlights on. Yeah, that totally lights it up properly. And that won't blind the uh, the pilot either. So I think that totally works. That's brilliant. Okie dokie. So that's it with just the yellow lights and the deck lights. And then this is it with the uh, spotlights on. You can't actually tell that they're yellow anymore, but I think that's fine. I think this is all actually A-OK. -okay. That is brilliant. Yeah, so we got our lights sorted out for those bits. Uh, we now need to figure out the rest of it. There's a lot of lights that need to go on this. I think deck lights should actually be controlled all the way around. So realistically, even though we've got deck lights at the back right here, um, we're actually going to go ahead and put them everywhere else as well. So I actually have one right here. I think we'll put it in the side. I think we'll put it right there. There we go. Excellent. That's good. We'll then have one in here. Okay, very nice. Good. We'll have one right about here. Oh, we can't. I guess we'll have it at the front. There we go. That's fine. Yes. Okay, good. Uh, so that I don't want like too many deck lights, but that works. Uh, then we'll obviously have some at the front as well. Probably just one at the very front. There we go. And maybe even just one here as well. I think that works. Yeah, I think that'll be okay. All right, good. So with that being said, uh, let's go ahead and uh, put this all in and we'll see if it works. Deck lights, here we go. Attach it to there, attach it to there, attach it to there. Very good. All right, this one, this one. 
Uh, this one and this one. Good. This one and this one. And that is all of them. Now they need electricity, so we'll do that real quick. There we go. Very good. Continue them around. Attach it under there. Yeah, okay, good. Attach it under there. We've intertwined everything, guys. We have intertwined everything. Uh, this one needs to go to there. Also needs to go to there. Oh, wow. Also needs to go to here. Also needs to go to here. Also needs to go to here. There we go. So that's more deck lights added. Hopefully they'll look okay. I think they will. I think they'll look okay. All right, inside we go. Forwards, very good. Turn on the spotlights, deck lights, yellow lights. There we go. So that's with the deck lights around everywhere else. I honestly think that works, yeah. And then obviously we've got the main gun that we can use here. Yep. Yeah. Does this have IR? Yeah, it does. So there we go. Do, 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 do. Camera switch. Oh, we've got a camera on both sides of the gun. Interesting. Um, so yeah, that's actually pretty cool. That is very cool. All right, fire. Nice. All right, yeah, totally works. Turn it off. There we go. Brilliant. Uh, that still works. That's the engine room. Uh, whenever we put fire suppression in, we'll put the fire suppression buttons in here, which would be excellent. Uh, what is this one? This one's the front of the ship. I think this one can control the anchor, maybe. I think that's a good idea. And then this one, I don't know what this is going to do. Probably all the interior lighting. And heating. Yeah, no, that makes sense. So this will be a control room for everything. Uh, yeah, that works. That totally works. And then obviously upstairs, we'll obviously have the... Um, the normal bridge. So if we go up here, we can get inside. We can have a normal bridge in here with all of the settings for the engines, how fast we're going, the fuel, everything like that. And we can also have a seat right here for the uh, helicopter as well. The helicopter landing. Maybe. I'm not sure. But that's cool. That totally works. Okie dokie. So uh, what we're doing now then is I think we'll actually add a few more lights to this little bit right here up here. Uh, because I feel like we should. So we'll just go ahead and smash that in right there. We'll also smash another one in right here. Uh, and that'll be all of the lights we pretty much need on the outside. So these are these are all deck lights. Um, so having them be deck lights is is completely fine. Uh, again, attach them to here. There we go. So deck lights, deck lights, deck lights, and deck lights. There we go. Um, which is awesome. That all works. Uh, we also need lighting on the inside as well. Uh, and I guess that'll be for this camera, which is this one. Yeah. No, that works. So we'll have lights inside of here. Don't really know what else we should have in here. We need some bunk rooms. We might actually make it go downstairs and have bunk rooms down here as well. Um, realistically, the command center should be lower in the ship. It should probably be down here, but never mind, I guess. Never mind. Um, so yeah, this is okay. This is this is okay. Um, right, attach those deck lights to the actual button, which we have. Uh, they're already attached to the electricity. We're going to go ahead and paint the things real quick. Uh, paint these real quick. And that's all good. Yeah, I don't want this thing to have too much logic so that it can't actually be used in multiplayer. I want it to be a very simple ship, essentially. So we're not going to do too much. There's going to be a few locked doors instead of dorm rooms, but uh, I think that'll be okay. All right, deck lights on, spotlights on. There we go. That is cool. That is honestly very cool. Turn the spotlights off. That's what it looks like. That's brilliant. That actually totally works. I like it. Okay, so the last thing that I want to do today then is I actually want to go ahead and grab this and we'll send it upstairs. So we'll grab this, we'll bring it in, and we'll put it upstairs straight away. So bring it in, put it up here, and we'll actually just have it in this window. That's fine. We'll have it all the way at the front. In fact, one back and paste it there. There we go. Awesome. Merge this in and we'll somehow sort of fill this in as well. So there we go. All right. Awesome. Gives us a little bit of room to add stuff in front of us. So that's pretty good. Um, but yeah, we're going to make it the same color as everything else. There we go, except the top piece and that bit, and I think that works, yeah. So spawn it in, let's get it driving, we'll see how fast it is, and we'll change things from there, maybe. Mm -mm -mm -mm. In we get, very good, let's go. Alright, so we got smoke this time, because it's infinite electricity. Uh, no, because it's not infinite fuel, uh, and that seems pretty good. It's a bit slow. We need to work on a stability system as well, but I think this works. Honestly, I think this is fine. Yeah. Okay, so let's say it was night time. Uh, we would obviously have lights on the inside of the ship as well, but we'd essentially go downstairs. Uh, you'd have multiple people, so this would be fine. But then you'd turn on all these, and that would be A-OK. -okay. So we've now got lights on the deck of the ship. We can now see. Um, and that's brilliant. Yeah. 
We also need some front spotlights as well, and I think they'll be controlled by where the anchor is. So that makes sense. Yeah. Oh, this is cool. This is actually very cool. I like it. Okay, so I actually think I am actually going to end the video here for now. We've added a little control room. I want to see what you guys actually think about the control room uh, and what other rooms we actually need inside this ship. So we need like a canteen because we need to be able to feed people. It doesn't have to be that big, but we do need one. Uh, we need a kitchen as well to actually feed the canteen or the people in the canteen. So we'll do that as well. Uh, we need some dorm rooms, which will probably have locked doors. So that's fine. We don't have to build an interior to those. Um, and then the engine room is already in, which is good. And then maybe a small med bay as well. Maybe one or two beds. So I think that's what we need. Uh, I'm not sure how well that's going to go, but I think that is what we need. Um, with that being said, I actually want to change the color of this again. Um, I kind of want to make the deck color this color. I do, but at the same time, maybe not. Nah, we'll leave it as is. That's fine. Um, but the exterior of the ship could be a different color if we wanted it to be. There we go. A little bit more blue. I don't know. Green. Whoa, no. Red? That's a weird looking ship. Um, but yeah, no, we need some details on the outside of this as well. We need to add, like, a number so that it looks like a military ship on the front. Maybe even here. Uh, and then I do want to add the stripes as well if I can. Um, I just want to add extra detail as, as long as, uh, as long as it doesn't mess with anything else. I think that'll be fine. Um, but anyway, for right now, thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.